when you wake up, this is what you gotta do You gotta crush the day before it crushes you Every day I'm here to motivate, lead the way in the AM I don't want you to hear these words, I need you to feel what I'm saying oh. You gotta crush the day before it crushes you You gotta crush the day before it crushes you In the building, Jimmy Wilson Motivation's coming, I can feel it First thing that you need to do Is crush the day before it crushes you Sometimes you're going to feel behind only to recognize in the future that you're right where you needed to be. So many of us entrepreneurs and high success driven individuals, we've got these huge goals. We constantly question ourselves and wonder why we are not farther ahead than where we are right now. And I think that's a good thing and a bad thing. It's good because you're always pushing yourself to get better, right? It's that 1% every day that makes that huge difference in the long run of your success. But sometimes you're going to feel like you're not as far along as you should be, right? And I think a lot of this happens, you know, in your gym and your fitness, right? Like you show up, you lift the weights, you start eating better, and you, you know, you reach a plateau. Initially, it's easy, right? Because all these things start happening because of previous choices, right? You didn't eat well, you didn't work out as many times as you should. And so, you know, you, you start to realize that initially there's this massive success. And then you hit a plateau. And you start to wonder why you're not farther along than you are, because you're doing the work, you're making all the right choices, right? And sometimes you have to sit back and understand that, you know, where you want to be, is someplace that you're not ready for just yet, right? Maybe you want to lift 400 pounds on a deadlift and you're still at that 325 mark. And what you don't realize is that you need to be at that 325 for a little while longer because it doesn't matter how hard you keep trying to hit that 400, if you haven't developed the form, if you haven't developed the motions, then your body is not going to be able to hit that 400 pound deadlift. So even though you feel like you've been putting in the effort and you've been trying hard to get to that goal, understand that if you're still at 325, it's for a reason. And this applies in every area of your life. Wherever you think you should be, you are where you are right now for a very specific reason. So look deeper on that. What can you do to get better? Where can you focus that energy knowing that if you just keep working on where you're at now, Eventually, you'll look up and be exactly where you want to be. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to go back and check out all the previous episodes. Make sure you subscribe and share this podcast with other like-minded, success-driven individuals who want to crush it. Check the show notes and grab your Crush of the Day swag over at crushingtheday.com. And remember, crush the day before it crushes you. You gotta crush the day before it crushes you.